Since 1981, Monty's Family Restaurant has kept it in the family. It's been a family restaurant in every sense of the word. Patriarch Sylvester Tagliamonte, now 83, founded the place 33 years ago, and he still keeps his hand in the restaurant. But his nephew has run Monty's for the last 14 years at their location just north of Harrison. 9 and 10's John McGowan stopped in to see the secret of their success in this week's edition of McGowan's Menu. It's pretty simple, says owner Marco Crisquello. You start with quality ingredients to be successful in cooking Italian. And then, of course, the recipes. You know, I learned from the best. I learned from my uncle, I learned from my grandmother, my aunts, and you know how Italian families are. So they made sure that I knew what I was doing and, and made sure that I did it right. And the man who started the restaurant, Uncle Sylvester, is still around. At 83, full-time retirement does not agree with him. So he's still busy at the restaurant he established 33 years ago. I make bread, I make soup, I make sauce, I pizza dough and uh, uh, pizza sauce and everything like that, spaghetti sauce, and all the preparation work. In an Italian restaurant, pasta and sauces are a big part of the menu, and Monte's has plenty of sauces from which to choose with a new one, soon to be added to the list. We do a marinara sauce, we have a meat sauce, we also have a mushroom and meat sauce, we have an Alfredo sauce that we make ourselves, and coming out in our new menus, we will have a tomato cream sauce, which is half marinara, half Alfredo, which has turned out to be really popular. We've run it on special a little bit. Another member of the family is in the kitchen. Karen Crisquello is whipping up some Italian beef tips, one of their popular entrees. It's a sirloin steak that we dice up. We saute green pepper, onion, mushroom, and olive oil, and uh, mix it all together, and they get their choice of potato or pasta on the side. As you would expect, the bread is all made here at Monty's, and it's used in all their sandwiches. They make their own sub buns for the sandwich they call the Big Monty. It has a lot of stuff on it. Uh, we put lettuce, tomato, and mayonnaise, Italian dressing on the bun. It comes with ham, provolone cheese, um, salami, American cheese, and roast beef, and turkey. I forgot about the turkey. Pizza is a big seller at Monty's. They sell a lot of takeout pizza as well as dine-in. We uh, make our own sauce. It's our own recipe, my uncle's recipe for many years. We uh, make our own pizza dough. Our sauce is a lighter sauce. It's a little bit thinner than what a lot of people are used to. I think that uh, the taste of the pizza should be all of the ingredients. There shouldn't be one dominating the other. All the ingredients for our pizzas are cut up fresh every morning. Um, we have numerous toppings for the pizza, and um, one of the popular ones is the Monty Special, which has three meats and three vegetables. Cannolis? Of course, they have cannolis. We have cannolis, and they're fairly popular. We have our regular uh, plain cannoli. We also have a what we call a chocolate cannoli, where mm -hmm. we hand dip the cannoli shells each end in, in some chocolate and those are pretty popular. Marco says the homemade chicken noodle soup, their uncle's recipe of course, just might be the most popular thing they have at Monty's. It's in constant demand. I don't know what it is about it. We make it in a huge pot um, at least twice a week, sometimes every other day, depending on how much we sell. Karen says a lot of what they serve is comfort food, and so when customers leave... I want them to feel comfortable when they're eating here. I want them to enjoy the food, of course, but I just... A well-rounded experience would be wonderful and hope they tell their friends and come back. We're concluding our visit to Monty's Family Restaurant with the Italian beef tips. You saw Karen preparing for us in the kitchen and every dinner here comes with homemade soup, salad and fresh homemade bread. Monty's Family Restaurant is located just north of Harrison on Old 27. They're open seven days a week for lunch and dinner. I'm John McGowan. Join us again next week right here for another edition of McGowan's Menu. And next week, John will visit Smoke on the Water in Charlevoix.